Well, today marked the first day of testing for COVID-19 within Longview ISD. Longview High School has more than 1,300 students who are learning on campus. CBS 19's JJ Maldonado was there as some students and staff volunteered to get tested for the virus. Today we're doing what's called an oral pharyngeal PCR test. Um, the results or the specimens will be collected here and sent out to a high complexity CLIA lab. Voluntary COVID-19 testing for Longview students, teachers and staff took place inside the Mickey Melton Center. Our goal with Longview and any school that we're going to be interacting with is going to be able to provide uh, FDA approved efficacious safe testing. More than 200 students and staff are expected to receive a swab or cheek test. On Friday, those that were tested will receive a second test, a PCR test that includes a finger prick and blood sampling. U.S. MedTest says the second test will confirm the results of the first test, as the virus is known to replicate. This is our, if you will, initial uh, customer in the state of Texas. Um, we are speaking to several different states and several different school systems throughout the country about where they're at and what they need to do and how we can help them if you can provide that safe, consistent environment for their teachers, for their faculty, for the people interacting with them. Longview High School principal James Brewer says he understands the hesitation of receiving the test, but says the process was simple. Uh, it's a volunteer uh, program that we're doing here on the campus. I volunteered as a principal on this campus, and I think it's a pretty good idea of testing to see if you're either positive or negative on the COVID-19. We got you covered, Longview. JJ Maldonado, CBS 19.